Go. I'm Jun Girola from the Asian Farmers Association. It's a regional federation of uh, 17 national farmer organizations in 13 countries in Asia. And uh, <clears throat> we are working for uh, the protection of uh, the rights of uh, smallholder farmers in the region. So we work with our members at the national level uh, to get their views, concerns, their issues, and um, to bring it to the regional and global level for uh, lobby and advocacy to promote their interests. And uh, we are here in this uh, land forum. We were invited by the MRLG and uh, land is a very central issue for smallholder farmers in the region. And we know that uh, smallholder farmers depend on land for their livelihood, for their dignity, for food security. So it performs uh, a lot of functions. Uh, so smallholder agriculture is uh, multifunctional. And um, uh, we always um, see the need to protect uh, the rights of smallholders to their land and uh, the need for government and other stakeholders to support, to invest in smallholder agriculture. Uh, there's a lot of um, talk and there's been a rush of uh, investments in land uh, starting with the global crisis in the 2008 and the AFA also got involved in this uh, dialogue at the global and regional levels and uh, uh, many of our farmers are wary of the kind of uh, investments that are happening in the region so we are talking about the ASEAN integration which uh, the ASEAN Economic Community, which started uh, this year, and uh, there is a lot of um, um, fear that uh, or concern that um, the integration process is uh, mainly being driven uh, by trade liberalization, uh, by um, the opening up of uh, trade. So it's more um, the policies that are being uh, crafted are more towards facilitating um, uh, investments, uh, foreign investments in the region. Uh, so we would like to bring uh, the concern of farmers that uh, we should not forget uh, the, uh, land rights, uh, food security, uh, and uh, the kind of investments that will promote smallholder agriculture in the region. So we are happy to be here to meet uh, other organizations working specifically in the Mekong region uh, to exchange uh, information and knowledge and hopefully be part of this ongoing dialogue and, uh, and the action to protect uh, uh, the rights of uh, people and communities uh, over their land.